Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Replay Dragon Quest IV. Last time, we started doing some stuff with Sorrow and putting him to use on our team, and kept fighting these two morons, uh, Fu Young and Chow Mein, and four different times. Really, I've, I think I faced them four times already. I was able to get some great equipment for Sorrow. I got the Pandemic Sword, Armor, and Shield, and now he's even in better shape than I could have possibly hoped for. Like, his attack power and defense are the best of everybody on my party right now, which is crazy to think about. He's good agility. I mean, he is just... Sorrow is in great shape. But we're not quite done yet, because as you can see, the dude's still got a helmet. He's got some boxer shorts on, it looks like. So let's see if we can keep going and keep fighting these idiots. So uh, I'll fight him again, and I'll let you know. And they keep saying this, these same things over, so... I'll keep fighting these idiots, and uh, I'll let you know what prize we get after uh, defeating him a fifth, uh, fifth time, I think I've fought him now? All right, let's go. There you go. No problems there. And some more experience. Ah, Sarah finally gains a level. Woo! Look at those increases in stats, 19 and 15. Good, 7th strength, 7th agility, that's all great. And he learns oomph, fantastic. That's great. And BCS Buster gains a level. Oh, <laughs> Kazapple. Oh, man, this just got a lot easier. And a level for Ragnar. And a level for Elena. God, she's at level 39 already. That's just ridiculous how powerful she is. She might hit 255, 255 naturally without the... Uh, Oh, and she learns Kerplunk. Very good. Can use that. And a level for Maya. Very good. Yep, no problem. Yeah, thank you. The same wing. All right, what do we get to get from this guy this time? Hey! We took his pants? He didn't have any clothes on! Oh, wait! <laughs> He's got a leaf covering his junk. <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. Oh my god. He's got... <laughs> oh my god, that is so funny. Oh gosh, that is so funny. Okay, her, that, okay if I give her that, that reduces her agility to 239, which is almost 255. So I'm wondering if I could... Give that to somebody else to... In fact, yeah, I'm going to do that. Do that, so that way I can take the Meteorite Bracer. Because Elaine has almost got max agility naturally anyway. So that Meteorite Bracelet... Let's see, what could I... How could I do with that? I'll give him to 12. That could be good for Omni Heal, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Let's give that to BCS Buster. So that he can get Omni Heal off faster. And I won't worry, necessarily worry about those elevating shoes for now. But Okay, very good! Alright, uh, so now we got oomph, so now I can, uh, boost my attack power, so that's great. Uh, Kazapple, which is a, cr this is a crazy ability, so this is all fantastic. Well, let's do this again. Uh, I'll jump out, I'll heal up, and, and, and you've seen me, the, de the dialogue's all the same, so I'll just win this battle again, and I'll meet you back once I've won the battle again. God bless. There you go. No problems there. With oomph, that makes that a lot easier. Also, I forgot to use Kasap with BCS Buster. He does a, does a nice job uh, hitting both of them, but we got him. Uh, level for Curl, level for Borea. Oh, Seed of Life. Cool. That's like a really rare drop, like a 1 out of 64 drop, so that's cool. Very good. All right, well, let's see what we get for defeating him a sixth time. Uh... <laughs> He's covering it up! <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that's fantastic. <laughs> okay, I don't know why I think that's so funny, but I do. <laughs> okay, uh, I'll be back. 
And there's another one. By the way, uh, on my way here, I got a level for Ragnar to get him up to 39. Jeez. Elaine is at level 40. Like, this is crazy. Yeah, she's going to have max agility without the meteorite bracelet. This is great. She's whooping some ass. And the level for Maya. Ah, she finally learns Kaboom. Nice. But Sarah's already got it, so. All right. Well, I I've got to assume I'm going to take his helmet next because I've clearly taken off the rest of his clothes. Yeah, I believe that's the helm, yeah. Whoa. And now this guy's just standing there naked covering his junk. Ah! And now we get the best helm in the game for a uh, sorrow. Right. Well, let's get that on him right away. Yeah, this hellish helm not only does it increase his uh, defense by 5 or 15, but it protects against snooze, whack, uh, instant death, and paralysis. So let's get that on him right away. He's just in such good shape right now. It's ridiculous. Okay, uh, is there anyone else I can equip the Iron Mask? He's got it. I don't think so. Yeah, so I'm going to have to go sell that, which I will. I might have enough money for another piece of... If I sell that, I might have another uh, liquid metal armor. So I may have to consider get, getting some of that. Hmm. I'll have to figure out what I'm going to do here. All right. Very good. Okay, well, is, I've decided I'm going to show you one more battle with these two because I want to show you uh, how powerful we are now and how quickly I can make work of these guys. Well, not quickly, but there's, it's still a little bit challenging. But now that I have oomph with sorrow... Uh, by the way, I also got BCS Buster up another level on the way. So this is going to be even better. So this guy, I just want to show you one final ba battle against these idiots. Uh so that I can show you exactly how I'm making this work. Okay, uh, I'm gonna use Kazap. I don't know why I didn't think to use this before. I guess I just wasn't pay atten paying attention. All right, let's go. Good shot, Elena. Woo, two criticals. Oh, that's a good way to start the battle. Look at that, jeez. Ooh, I'm gonna survive this. Actually, we should be all right, we should be all right. We should be all right. Very good. And now, let's go ahead and use Oomph on Ragnar for the first round, because Elena will probably get a shot off. Yeah. And now with the Meteorite Bracelet, it's much faster for us to get Omni Heal off as well. Damn it! That's still a good amount of damage, though. Uh, so that's actually pretty useful there. But that can happen. So now I would go ahead and use Kasap uh, with, with BCS Buster if you have the opportunity to do so. Oh! Good shot. That's it. Shot Elena. Yeah, and also a good way to do it because of the sending up the cloud of feathers. Ow. There we go. All right, very good. So, and now let's use Oomph on Elena. Kazap, and that way, if, uh, I use Kazap too, and, and, I want, and I'm okay to do that now that my BCS Buster has more MP. I, I, I guess I could have done that before, but... Yeah, you know, I have 340 damage. Like, that's just ridiculous. Omni Heal. Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah, I wanted to use Omni Heal. I wanted to use Omni Heal, yeah. Yeah, look at that. I mean, I'm just doing so much more damage now. And I can take these... Yeah, look at how quickly I defeated him uh, with that. So that's fantastic. And now I can't lose my... Uh, Uh, go ahead, Omni Heal. I have enough MP to do that. Uh, and now I can't. Uh, disruptive Wave won't happen. So now I've got my. Now I've got my. Uh, I'm really ready to whoop this guy's ass. So this should be good. Uh, do it. Go ahead and full heal Elena. BCS Buster, why don't you now use. Zap and attack, just in case he uses his feathers. Okay, I think he defended. Okay, Ragnar's oof word off. 
which is fine, we can just reestablish that. And attack. Look how much damage I'm doing. Like, it's just ridiculous. How does that ground recover, by the way? Like, 314 damage. Like, that's just ridiculous. Um, with Sorrow, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and cast Kaboom. Just in case he uses the stupid feathers thing. Woo! I don't like that. I thought it was against Ragnar. And again, if one of your party members dies, just bring in Curl and use Kazing, because uh, Kazing is guaranteed to to work. Uh, Sorrow, why don't you use Kaboom? Kazap, because that actually does more damage than regular Zap. And we got him! Yeah, that's a lot easier with a little bit more powerful characters. Ooh, and Sorrow gained level 20 and 20 stats! Good lord! Look at that stats increase! That's fantastic! That level for Boria? Yeah, that's awesome. Yes, indeed. I sure don't! Wait, how do you know my name? Uh, sure. Thank you. Wait, what? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yes. <laughs> That's funny. Wait, whoa! Whoa! The guy's back! Oh, this guy came to life! And he's naked! Walk the... What the hell is going on? Practical Yoker? Wow. Uh, that's true. Right, well, let's talk to him. Let's find out. Who is this guy? Uh-huh. Wait, how did... Wait. Uh-huh. Oh, BCS Buster Town? <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. How did he live in a picture? Sure. That sounds like just... Wait, old man Sorrow? Wait, is that Sorrow's dad? I I don't know. I'm furious. <laughs> Enigma. <sighs> All right. All right. Let's go. Let's go to BCS Buster Town and see if I can find him. But yeah, I mean, my goodness, like, Sarah just continues to be a machine. It's absolutely ridiculous. Okay, let's, uh, let's head to BCS Buster Town. Let's see if I can find, uh... Oh, by the way, we have, if you have Sarah in your lead, you have some new world map music. So I'm just gonna let this play for a little bit, because this is pretty cool music. Yeah, so pretty cool new world map music there from Sorrow. So, all right, let's head to BCS Buster Town. I want to see if I can find this dude. Thank you. Right. Okay, let's see if we can find this old man Sorrow here in BCS Buster Town. I actually can't even remember where he is. So it might take me a little minute to find him. But uh, yeah, it's been a while since I've been to BCS Buster Town. Or B I should say BCS Buster Kingdom, because it's, it's what it is now. It's a kingdom. Okay, let's see if I can find this moron. Well, actually, no, he's he's not a moron, per se. I just, like I said, I can't remember where he is. Um, all right, well, I'm going to walk around BCS Buster Town until I can find this guy, because, like I said, I can't quite remember where he is. See, so, yeah, let me just walk around until I find him. Oh, okay, I remember where he is now. All right, so if you could just go to the front of the castle and then just go straight up. This way. Ah, there he is. Eh, Sorrow Queen of the Desert. 
Huh? What? It. Eh. Uh. All right. That's kind of weird, but all right. V very good. Okay. Well, that's all that I really can do with uh, Sara and all that stuff right now. So that's all I really wanted to do with today's episode. Now, uh, if you want to do some more level grinding, and I may need to do this. I want to run some test runs to see if I actually need to do this. But uh, if you want to do some more level grinding, I would definitely say the best place to do it is to just go back. I think you can fight uh, Chow Mein and Fu Young again, I think. Uh, I can't remember. I, I have to go back and check. If you can, I would say just fight them over and over and over again. I'll have to go back and check. Um, but, uh, if not, just go look for the, the King Metal Slimes and all this stuff like I showed you a few episodes ago, and we should be good to go. But what is the final task that we can do with Sorrow, and thus the final quest, the final task in Dragon Quest 4? You'll have to wait until next time to find out. Then this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter, BCS Buster LP. Follow me on Twitch, on twitch.tv slash BCS Buster. Check out all the ways that you can support me in the video uh, in the video description. Uh, again, using those promo codes and those apps not only saves you money, but it also uh, helps the channel as well. Until the next time we meet, take care, y'all.